check out my five tips to make your home sell successful for 2020. And that's what I'm talking about today. And I'm starting right now. Everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Angela O'Hare, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And welcome to my seller series. And in this series, I like to talk about things that's gonna help you get your home ready to sell, how to sell it, and all kinds of other advice for you as a seller. If you're thinking about putting your home on the market for 2020, I'm gonna go over five tips to help you sell your home faster and for more money. Tip number one, price your home correctly in the beginning. A lot of sellers like to price their home over the market value because they feel that if they price it high, then they'll eventually get it to the low. That is a wrong strategy. I do not recommend that strategy at all. The reason being is that if you price it high and you wait for someone to come in and then offer you a lower value, your home could be sitting on the market for quite some time. The most important factor is that your home needs to be priced at or below market value. Because if it is priced right, then you're going to get all those potential viewers, buyers to come in and look at your home. And that could also create a potential bidding war because you brought in a lot of people that were interested in that price range. And if they really, really love your house, then the multiple offers will come in. It's very important that you price your home right the first time because the first two weeks of the listing is the most crucial time of the listing. And if it's priced high and it sits on the market for a long time, then you're eventually gonna get it to the price that I told you to list it at. And now your home has become stale. So then now the buyers may ask for a lot of concessions like closing costs and um, home warranties and all that other things that are related to the sale. So it's important that if you price accordingly, we sell it fast and have very little concessions to worry about. Number two, get professional photos taken. Listings with professional photos are said to get 118% more views than listings without professional photos. Ask your real estate agent if they hire a professional photographer. A lot of agents cut corners and they take the photos themselves with their own cell phone. And they're not doing justice for your home or your listing or doing justice for you to sell your home faster. With everyone shopping online, Zillow, Realtor.com, Trulia, the more clear, the more crisper your photos are, the faster your home is going to sell. Trust me. And when you're interviewing real estate agents, ask them if they use a professional photographer. And if they don't, I'd give them the door. I wouldn't hire them at all. No matter how much they say they do this and do that, <laughs> they're cheap agents if they don't use a professional photographer. Number three, offer virtual tours. Now virtual tours is nothing new, but with the whole social distancing, everyone staying home these days, it's very important that potential buyers get to see exactly what your home looks like. And having an agent that provides a virtual tour for your home is going to do wonders for your listing. Your home will sell faster because the buyers can see the ins and outs of your home. They can actually just look at everything. And we get a lot of out of state clients. So if you offer a virtual tour, then they can shop and look at your home at the comforts of their home. So it's very important, again, that you hire an agent that offers a virtual tour, especially with all things that's going on right now. Number four, highlight attractive neighborhoods and amenities. If you live in a community that has beautiful parks, a community pool, you want to make sure that your real estate agent hires a photographer that takes photos of those amenities. And you also want to showcase and advertise those amenities in your listing because people are not only buying your home, they're buying the neighborhood. And if you know me, I sell neighborhoods, not only homes. I love to do neighborhood tours because 
People want to see what the neighborhood looks like. They want to see what your actual neighbors look like. They don't want to get a sense and feel of the community without having to go to the community. And again, that ties into the whole virtual tour aspect with everyone staying home and shopping online. It's important to depict a great picture of not only your home, but also the community that you live in. And number five, protect yourself and prospective buyers when they're viewing your home. The safety of yourself and potential buyers should be taken into account when you're listing in 2020. You need to possibly provide hand sanitizers at the entry and make sure that all buyers and agents or anyone that's coming through your home follow the direct guidelines provided by our governor, wear a mask, possibly wear booties, and possibly wear gloves. Advertise that your home is protected and it's a safe environment for potential buyers to come and visit. I know it's a crazy time to sell and I understand your leeriness of wanting to sell. However, I've done a video on why now is a great time to sell due to everything that's going on in the world. If I was a seller and I can sell, now is an awesome time to do so. Take advantage of what it's going on in the real estate market right now. Homes are selling for top dollar. There's not a lot of competition going out there. And we don't know what the market's gonna look like in a couple of months. So if you can, and you want to, let's list your home. Hopefully you're enjoying my seller series and enjoying all these tips that I'm providing you on what is the best way to price your home, how to sell your home, and get it ready to get all those showings and to make some money, right? My goal is to make top dollar on your home. If you are thinking about selling your home in the Las Vegas Valley, you can always give me a call at 702-370-5112 or I posted a seller form link down in the description below. As always, if you like this video, be sure to hit that thumbs up button, leave a comment down below, share with a friend, and consider subscribing to my channel if you're interested in learning everything and anything about Las Vegas real estate, the Las Vegas Valley, neighborhoods surrounding our beautiful city, or anything else. Thank you so much for watching today, and I can't wait to see you guys on the next one.